G'day guys, welcome back to another episode of Vince Venturing. We've got the Akubras on, but we've left the coast behind. Yep. We're, uh, we're on route to the snowy mountains. Um, we're going to the northern section, a bit we haven't really explored too much. Um, so looking forward to showing you what's around. You can see it glistening in the distance. No trip to the snowy mountains is complete. We had a visit to the giant trout in Adam in a bit. This is the destination. You've got to line up for it. <laughs> so majestic. Main street of Anamitibi. It's a hoot of a town. Look for cars. So they do have a trout. Well, they do have a giant trout. Made it to Long Plain Hut Campground. Busy. Busy than I thought. There's a nice storm rolling in. Yeah, I think the perils of um, rooftop tent camping is finding a level site. <laughs> I feel like you're a bit more limited, but we'll figure it out. Yeah. Need to find some ramps. Long Plain Hut. So apparently this hut has been many things in its time, but one of the things that I thought was the funniest was that it's actually been like a pub slash dance hall, um, which is kind of funny to think because they said it was quite spacious, but it's <laughs> really small. Just picturing people dancing here and having piano and drinks, it seems really cool. A rustic looking out house. <laughs> Luxury life with the drop toilets. The mozzies are bad. They're like turquoise mozzies. Camping. <laughs> Camping it. essential. Love it. This smells better than Aerogard, FYI. It smells a lot better. <laughs> Are you ready for a swim at Urangabilly Hot Pools? Oh yeah, can't wait to jump in that water. Uh, from memory, it's not that hot though. 23 degrees and it's currently 20 degrees outside, so slightly warmer. Okay, here. we swam here in winter once in the snow, it was pretty cool. So we are here and we have to walk yeah. It's not too far of a walk and it's definitely worth it because you end up here. Alrighty, so the walk isn't even that bad. We're nearly there. Try saying that when we're walking up. I know, I remembered it kind of being a bit longer and steeper, but yeah, we'll huff and puff on the way back <laughs> up and tell you what we think. Hey Monique, are you going to do a flip? I'm going to do it. No. <laughs> it's so deep, eh? It's so clear. <laughs> this is awesome. Does this bring back memories of like 10 years ago when we were here? Yeah. Yeah. 10 years ago. Amazing. <laughs> He's done the hot. Now he's gonna do the cold. Is it warm? Oh, 
<laughs> that looks amazing. This is so warm. <laughs> it's like a freaking car. Seriously. How do you see Monique in the freezing cold water. It is cold. And here's where it gets so nice. Oh. It just feels like a bloody bath up here. Yeah. Oh, that's amazing. Because that little stream is coming from the hot pool. Oh, there's a spider web through there. Look at that way. Oh, yeah, big spider. There's two. Spider web right there. Big spider. Wow, this place is so gorgeous. You're freshed after that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so. 10 out of 10, must do. Yeah. You tie your horses up. Yeah, these are amazing. So the snowy mountains are dotted with all these huts, but this one has to be the best one we've seen so far. We haven't even gone in. Mm, probably just go huts. You look them up on Google. They like info on pretty much every hut. Look, <laughs> it's not good head height for me or me actually. The cheese hut. My type of hut. Well, Nick's found his new high country home. Okay, this, will do me. <laughs> this is amazing. So cool. So much character there, isn't it? Yeah, it's a pretty long drive out, but it's worth it. Oh, how do you do it? Oh, it's like a little lock. Oh, look at that house. Let's go explore this one. Coolman Murray Caves. Wow. You can see it's definitely blue. It's like yeah. at Janolan Caves. Yeah. Here's the entrance to the cave. I never research anywhere that Nick takes me, so every time we go somewhere, I'm so surprised. 
snowy mountains, good all year round, but even better in winter. Well, we've done every single thing. Yeah. Truth be told, this is about our 100th trip to the snowy mountains. We've never been here. But that's right, we've never been here. Man, that water is crystal clear. Yeah. If it wasn't for a few things floating on top, you wouldn't know there's even water there. I'm still on the right track. Wow. This is so cool. Just in a cave. Apparently that goes for like hundreds of meters, but we just tried with our phone torches and no go. Not good enough. Pretty coincidental that just back around that corner, the river's flowing. Even there, it kind of looks there, like it is. But the same river is bone dry and even upstream, there's not a drop of water. Because what's interesting around here is the waters go in caves underground and then just literally rise up. Yeah, they call them the disappearing rivers, I think. Yeah, so I'd imagine that's probably where, like the hot pool we were in this morning, it just bubbles its way up. It's pretty cool. Fun facts with Nick. Okay, don't, don't quote me on that, but... No, that sounds right to me. Sure don't quote us on anything, to be honest, ever, but... <laughs> And now the water's back. Same river, but not even a hundred meters, and it's flowing again. It's so weird. So cool. First hike of the year. You first hike of 2022. We're making it a cracker. I love it. There is not one part of this walk that's not stunning. I really feel sorry for Monique having to uh, edit all this footage because it's just so good. Yep. I can't stop filming. <laughs> you turn the corner and the landscape just changes to like grassy hills. Back that way is super gnarly, sharp rocks. This walk is short, but it shows so much of the area. Yeah. Awesome. I just wanted to say, if you don't hike, why not? Why not? This is so pretty. You're missing out. There. So many brumbies. Crazy. You can tell this part of the uh, trail. Same trail is less used because the uh, it's, it's a pretty faint uh, walkway. There's our dry river bed again. We nearly finished the hike of Nichols Gorge, which was epic. Um, but hot tip is if you have a good head torch, bring it because the two massive caves that we walked into, you can really go and explore them. So we missed out this time, but maybe next time, but can recommend. It was awesome. <laughs> Men make fire. Nice. 
not a bad spot to set up camp for the night. Oh, yeah. Yep. Magpie flat? Okay. I'm gonna call it magpie flat, I have no idea. Okay. <laughs> this is Liv and Barry. And fashion. See? I'm not mad. There's Nick's disappearing water. I'm not mad. <laughs> Proof. You were right. I'm not mad. <laughs> There's a cave in this waterfall. This place is like adventurous paradise. Wow. How cool is that? <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> this is more of an adventure than we'd set out. <laughs> and involves crawling on your hands and knees through a cave. Oh, that's kind of scary. <laughs> it's kind of scary, and you're not even oh. claustrophobic. Oh my god. We made it. That's hard work. Yeah, I don't know how the hell we're getting back through there. I'm so dead. <laughs> Alrighty, so there's where we're supposed to be on the other side of the river. I think we took a wrong turn and ended up in a cave. Just down there. Still pretty cool. I think we might be able to bush bash and cross over there though. What the heck are we doing? This is not the trail. This is, <laughs> this is just typical us being a bit stupid. <laughs> It's freezing. Oh man, my feet are dead. <laughs> it is bloody freezing. Oh. Thank God I wore shorts. Woohoo! <laughs> it's not even halfway. Oh, <laughs> oh, they just like went stinging. So that's the cave over there that we boldly decided we would crawl into. And we popped out up here. Nick took a video from here and then we had to cross the river down there and this is where we're supposed to be on this nice trail. Wow, I think this walk is more spectacular than yesterday's. Alright, have a look at that. Like that is just awesome. Mate, this is an absolute must-do if you're out in the Long Plain area of Kosciuszko National Park. Wowie. It is just so, so cool. Like, that water looks so inviting except it feels like it's about 10 degrees. So maybe not. There's so many lizards. <laughs> They're freaking me out like always. I'm always the one that gets sacrificed. Has to go first. Right, time for another water crossing.
don't even know if you can see the color of this water, but it's like just turquoise blue. It's what you'd expect to come out of a glacier. Yeah, it does look very glacial. I guess we're in the snowy mountains, but there's no snow. Stunning. Feels like we're getting closer. Right, another, another little cave. I think by that sound, we've approached the waterfall. I'm pretty sure that's the ACT in front. Wow. Wow, they're pretty substantial falls. I think this is the 21st river crossing we've done today. <laughs> wraps up our snowy mountains episode first of many um, i'm sure we'll be back down here and show you guys a lot more to do especially in the winter um, thanks for watching yeah every season is different here it is so amazing you guys know what to do like subscribe thumbs up ring the bell everything to support our channel and we will catch you on the next one